Hello traders, FS Pip to here. Today is Thursday, September 7th, and I'm going to be analyzing the US dollar Canadian, starting on the monthly, working my way down to the one hour time frame. So on the dollar Canadian, to me, it still looks very impulsive down, and it looks like one, two, three waves up. And then what happened was it made another three waves up and impulsive up. So at this point, it probably is at least going to make an attempt to come back up near these highs before it really does go up back down and try to continue the downtrend. Trend. So let's head down to the weekly time frame. On the weekly time frame is where you can see impulsive down, three waves up, and then one, two, three, four, five down with a break of structure to the upside. Definitely looks like an ABC Kretzer, which means that it probably is going to at least attempt to go up and take out these highs. Maybe it will end up making a lower high, but I still think that eventually it is going to try to continue the downtrend. So until that happens, let's head down to the daily. So on the daily, I got my Fibonacci retracement measuring this whole move down. We are not even to the 78% yet. I mean, it definitely has a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 shape, but we see no break of starts. We see no Fibonacci bounce. We don't even see engulfing moves down. That tells me that I am for sure going to continue to look for longs on sort of time frames. So taking it down to the 4 hour time frame, our most recent starts level on the 4 hour is right here. So for me at least, until we get a break of starts to the downside right here, I am for sure only a buyer on the sort of time frames. I am definitely only looking to go long, and I'm only looking to go long on ABC pullbacks. So let's take a look at that on the one hour time frame. On the one hour time frame, like I said, I'm only buying right now. It looks like impulsive down, honestly, and it looks like it may have already even made a B and a C. So it kind of already looks like we may have a Kretz, and I mean, it, I see three waves down, I see impulsive up. It'd be nice to see it take out this structure to really confirm that it is going up, but it looks like we already have the end of a Kretz in. And honestly, even if it does go down again, I don't really care, honestly, because unless it goes down and takes out this low, I am for sure only looking for buys in an uptrend. If it does take out that low, then I will definitely start looking for sells, but until that happens, I'm looking for three-way pullbacks to go long for the continuation of the uptrend. So don't forget to join my free Discord group. The link for that is on the screen and in the description. Thanks and happy trading.